Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Robin Deschamps here. I'm in Pasadena, California, and I'm at the famous Victory Park. Every year after the Rose Bowl Parade ends, this is the park where it comes as a resting point. And people from all walks of life and cities and countries come here to pay the respects to the floats that have been marching down the main street on New Year's Day or shall I say on Rose Bowl Day before the football game whoever is playing that football game I feel like this is a pretty big park but it's really only on one side it's not much here Except for they got like a gymnasium and it's just a regular park with a few flowers and things like that. And I'm on the main street here of uh, Altadena Drive and, Pal and Paloma Street. Which is just uh, north of Colorado Boulevard. Cut the, cut the floats actually do turn and it goes north. It goes from, from uh, west to east and then it goes north up Sierra Madre Boulevard but I'm on the adjoining street from where the actual plaque is that's here so this is Victory Park and uh, been here quite a while a little bit after the or a little bit before the city was incorporated in 1886 well that'll be all folks talk to you in another video One thing I failed to mention about the Rose uh, Bowl floats was that uh, back in the 80s, I think it was either free, a dollar, or about five dollars. I can't remember exactly what it was, but now, just to see the floats being parked at the end of the parade for a couple of days is like 20 to 25 dollars. And usually it's hard to find a place to park, and so maybe some people are, are charging you for parking fee. I don't know. But usually you have to park the street and then you walk to the park. Okay, that's all folks. Talk to you later.